Welcome to another Business Tech Planet video. Today, we'll show you how to fix this selection as locked in Microsoft Word. First, we'll talk briefly about what causes the error. Then we'll show you how to fix it. There are two main causes of the selection as locked error in Word. One cause is an unactivated version of the desktop application. And another is that the document has been protected. To resolve both of these issues, please view the following guide. If you're using an unactivated version of Microsoft Word, you'll see an error informing you under the ribbon. You'll also notice unlicensed product next to the document name at the top. If you have a Microsoft 365 account that includes the desktop applications, you can resolve this by clicking the activate button in the error message. Then, if you have a product key, choose to enter it. Otherwise, click the sign in or create account button. You can then sign into your account and activate the product. Users with a business account will see the option to enroll their device. Enrolling your device grants your organization powerful control over it, including the ability to perform a factory reset. So if you're using a personal device, we recommend unchecking the box, unless you're sure it's safe to enroll. You now have the option to sign into this app only, or to allow Microsoft to sign you into all your applications. If you don't have a license that covers the desktop applications, you can click the Use Free button in the error message. Doing so will take you to the Microsoft 365 homepage in your browser, where you can access the free online applications. You can also click Activate, and then choose Sign In or Create Account. Then, in the pop-up, hit Create One. When you click Activate, you may see the option to start a free trial, which is another way to continue using the desktop applications. However, it's important to note that the free trial only lasts for 30 days. If you can't see the activation error, it's more likely that the document is protected. To check that, click Review at the top. Then head over to Protect, and select Restrict Editing. If the document is protected, you should have the option to stop protecting. Hit Stop Protection. If the document is password protected, you'll need to enter the password to proceed. Unfortunately, there's no way around the password protection, so if you don't know it, ask the person who created the document, or copy and paste the content into a new file. That's all for this video. We hope it was helpful. Check the description for additional links and resources. And leave a comment below if you have any concerns or questions. Thanks for watching. And don't forget to subscribe for more Microsoft videos.